Hello, lovely chicken nuggets. How are you? I miss you guys so much. I'm sorry I've not been consistent. Before I start, I want to say thank you so much for 500 lovely chicken nuggets. I appreciate each and every one of you. You guys mean a lot to me. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much for all your support. I love you so much. <laughs> Oh my god. That's weird. I filmed a dark academia outfit transformation but it turned out great. And I decided to either scream or hang out with you guys. I chose to hang out with you guys instead of screaming. I hope you're having a nice day. I just finished binge watching Get Even. It's a British high school TV show about four friends who are in a secret group that investigates and expose bullies in their school. We are DGM. We don't get mad. We, we get, get even. even. It's kind of like Mozzy. I really can't wait for the second season because it turns out the secret society that they are actually in there is more to it than the girls are actually aware of the next show that i also binge watched is Ginny and georgia Ginny. Ginny is actually the daughter of georgia a very ambitious and strong scary woman her character really terrifies me She's so unpredictable. I start to question her innocence in a lot of situations in the movie. The family tend to move around a lot. This have really affected Ginny's social life. Georgia moving her family to the north in search of a normal life actually turned out to be something positive for Ginny. You're gonna lack Massachusetts. Perfect for a fresh start. We move a lot, so I'm always the new girl. She got the chance to actually make some interesting friends. Whenever she's around her friends, I get Zoe from Greenwich vibes. I am definitely looking forward to the next season because of Georgia's statement at the end of the season. What did he say? Hey! Sixteen-year-olds care about. When I was sixteen, all I cared about was smashing the patriarchy and burning it all down. constitute a revolution. Muggsy is actually an empowering movie. It tackles the day-to-day -day injustice that females face. I know people debate on how corny the movie is but the message it conveys is about something very sensitive in our society so that alone gets it a 10 over 10. Some scenes in this movie will actually have your blood boiling. Can I help you? I don't know can you? He's bothering you. He's harassing me. If you use that word, that means I have to do a bunch of stuff. If you're doing nothing, then you're part of the problem. The fact that this is actually reality makes it very sad. The second show is Behind Her Eyes. This one is a very mind-twisted TV show. Pinch myself and say, I am awake. Look at my hands. Count my fingers. Stay calm. The level of plot twist in this, you know the kind of TV shows that you run to YouTube after watching just to hear other people's perspective. This is one of them. It will leave you with a lot of questions. Louise, who is a single mother, starts an affair with her boss, David. And in the midst of all this, a friendship between Louise and David's wife, Adele, is developed. Adele is a very mysterious character. You need to learn to control your dreams, Louise. You and me, we're special. It gets slow, but trust me, it's very interesting. It will leave you with a lot of questions. What are some of your favorite shows? I hope you're having a nice day. A lot have been going on lately. I think that's why I'm binge watching a lot of shows lately because I'm finding it as a way to escape reality, which is actually not a good idea. But it is what it is. It is, it is what it is. I'm sorry if I've not been consistent. I really love you guys. You guys mean so much to me. You guys have no idea. 
sometimes i just wish i can actually know the people who are subscribed to me but it's not like instagram but just know that even though i don't know you i appreciate you a lot it was actually nice hanging out with you guys it was actually really nice talking to you guys i know i'll probably cut a lot of this out that's what i do like i have to stop this i tell myself this part is boring this part is boring okay they do be boring though but i told myself this part is boring this part is boring eventually and then i end up cutting out everything for vanishing let me know what content you guys would love to see on this channel and if you guys like the quest to find our aesthetic let me know what other aesthetics you like me to talk about and i'll see you in the next one bye love you